Okay, so these are called primary trig ratios. You guys know them as so Katoa. Okay. That's a little acronym that helps us remember what the ratios stand for. So sine and the angle x is equal to the opposite side of the triangle divided by the hypotenuse. Cos x is the adjacent side divided by the hypotenuse. And tangent of the angle is opposite divided by adjacent. So so Katoa. We'll write it on the side in case you guys don't remember. Right underneath. Right. So yeah, so Katoa. Okay, I'm going to make up some angles here. This is, again, an impossible triangle. This doesn't exist. I'm just making numbers up so we get used to the process of this. So if I ask you, all I really want is you guys to set up ratios. So if I ask you what the ratio for sine 30 is, but we know sine is opposite. So what is opposite of 30 degrees? 3. So, so that's 3. And the hypotenuse is 8. So that's it. The ratio is 3 over 8. I just want you to be able to give me ratios. So then, no, I don't care for you guys to solve it. I just want the ratio. So cos 30. Well, cos is adjacent. What's the adjacent side? 5. Divided by what's the hypotenuse? 8. And what will tangent 30 be? That's right. That'll be adjacent, or sorry, opposite, which is 3, over adjacent, which is 5. And then, what if I were to ask you the opposite angle there? If I were to ask you what sine 60, what would the ratio for sine 60 be? This is the opposite, and this is still the hypotenuse. So we get 5 over 8. Cos 60, yeah, will give us 3 over 8 because 3 is now our new adjacent. And tan 60 will be the inverse of what we had before, so we'll get 5 over 3. I want you guys to just take a look at these relationships here. Sine 30 gives us the same ratio as cos 60 does. Cos 30 gives us the same ratio as sine 60. And our tangents, when we switch angles, are inverses of each other. 3 over 5 and 5 over 3. So, for your quiz, I just want you guys to be able to give me ratios. Just set those ratios up, okay?